Hello friends, welcome to Magistus Tarot with me, Magistus Mifta. And today we are in the month of December. Yes, we're finally here at the last month of the year. I know that so many of you guys are expecting that 2020 need to be over, over really soon. But before this year to be over soon, there are still something that we can learn from the month of December. And here I am helping you guys to find the advices that you need to learn for the month of December. So if you are interested, let's start. So the first card we have Five of Cups. Five of Cups represents a lot about regret. And I think this card advises us that whatever happened to us this year, we shouldn't feel any regret at all, especially in the month of December. I think there are still so many things that we can learn from all the things that is not pleasant that happening this year. The second card, we have Four of Wands inverted. Well, this card represents conflict, represents separation, or maybe like family issues, but don't be afraid of that. Let's not focus on that. Let's focus on the advices that might tell us. Well, I guess this card advises us to just accept whatever happened this year. Maybe we are separated with someone that used to be our family or someone that is close to us, but just related to the previous cards. Maybe like we shouldn't feel regret at all if we are separated with some of the people. Maybe like that's the best for us. Maybe like that's the part that we can actually learn a lot from that. And you know, some people out there are no longer serving us any good. And I think that we should just accept and let go of these people. The next card we have inverted the star. Well, I know that this inverted card has like a negative connotation, but don't be afraid of that. I think the card advises us that if we can letting go of someone that is no longer serving us any good and if we are not regretting anything that happened in this year, maybe like it's actually protecting us from becoming a person with so many attachment. You know, those kind of attachment can actually make us, you know, not successful or it's like preventing us from becoming the star that we should become. I still actually have the next card. We have Eight of Pentacles that represents a lot about productivity, about creating stuff, about producing things, being productive in general. So I guess that if we combine all of the cards that we already uh, read here, that, well, that's kind of correlate with this one. If we are not regretting, if we can let go, if we can let go of all the attachment, we can actually learn a lot to produce and becoming more productive. And this also advises us just keep being productive even though this is actually December where people are, you know, having the holiday mood and everything. But just because of that, that doesn't mean we should stop producing things and being productive. The last but not least, we have my favorite, King of Wands. Well, many tarot readers out there have different interpretations with the King of Wands. But especially with this deck, I like to relate this with the fatherhood. The father figure, the nurturing uh, masculine energy. And I think this card advises us to embrace our fatherhood, our nurturing. But at the same time, we need to be logical, just like a good father. Even though that you are a woman, maybe like this month, December, we should really embrace that thing maybe that it's really necessary because we are going to meet a lot of people, meet a lot of our family members. Um, and I think that's really necessary. And maybe like this is also the presence from all of our struggle from this year. So just embrace this meditative card, King of Wands. So those are the advices for the month of December. So if you guys are interested in having an annual reflection reading with me, I am here to help you. We can actually talk about anything that you already learned this year and what needs to improve for the next year. So I hope that my video is useful for you. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time. Bye.